Hi Geyser Road students, it's Mrs. Lewis here, and I hope that you are all doing well, staying home, staying safe, and spending some quality time with your families. Uh, this week, as we think about social emotional learning, I wanted to talk to you guys about um, mindfulness. And mindfulness is something that many of you are practicing in your classrooms. Um, some of you might have been doing calm classroom stuff. Uh, and it's a great way to transition between activities, uh, a nice way to wake up in the morning, or to, an activity to do before you go to bed at night. So when we think about mindfulness, I made this mindful flower, and um, I thought about the different things that mindfulness means to me. So um, some of those things might be positivity, acts of kindness, um, feelings of calm, being calm and relaxed, um, really being present in the moment, um, and engaging in uh, kind activities, breathing, um, really being in, in touch with um, how you're feeling and being able to express that. One of the uh, activities that we can work on for practicing mindfulness is grounding exercises. And a grounding exercise is a way to get in touch with your senses and um, being able to focus your thoughts on one activity. So an example of that would be taking a walk in the garden, name something you would see, something you would smell, something you would hear, feel, and taste. And you can do a grounding exercise about literally anything. It could be about watching baseball. It could be about standing in the rain. Climbing a tree. It could be about blowing bubbles. A grounding exercise can be about anything. Another fun grounding exercise is to trace your hand and then inside each of your fingers, um, name a different sense and something that brings you joy. So one of your senses you might do taste and uh, draw a picture or write about something that brings you joy through taste. So for me, it would be eating chocolate. Um, think about hearing, what's a sound that brings you joy? Um, for me, it would be like the sound of the ocean. Do that for all five of your senses. And that's a fun um, activity that you can um, do that involves drawing or writing um, and being creative. I wish you guys all well. I hope that we get to be together again soon. And I miss you all. Bye.